Hello, everyone. This is From Milwaukee to Nashville. I'm Daniel Goodman, and over there is John Graphic Man Lewandowski. <laughs> so, John, um, uh, should we build them in before we get into our sponsorship uh, about why yesterday? Uh, both of us were kind of under the weather. Yeah. We both needed forklifts to remove us from our beds. We were that <laughs> exhausted. Yeah, we literally were. Um, so, uh, yeah, yesterday it was just not our day. So, um, uh, we were just not feeling well. That's why we didn't do anything. Um, congratulations. I believe the, both teams did, uh, play solid, um, but it wasn't the greatest games for them. Uh, the Admirals had to rebound tonight. Uh, I know that the Preds fell to Vancouver. Um, but let's get into today's game while we're here. Oh, and before we do that, our show is brought to you by the wonderful folks at Hockey Locker, 202 West Howard Avenue, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. You can call them at 414-800-7585 or visit their website at hockeylockermilwaukee.com. And today's show is also brought to you by the return of the Boo Bucket. <laughs> well, I sit here and eat my apples and nuggies and fries. <laughs> <laughs> Well, John does that. All right. So today the Admirals took on the, the Belleville Senators. Shots on goal in the first period. Milwaukee outshot Belleville 5-4. to four. In the second period, Belleville outshot Milwaukee 9-7. to seven. In the third period, Belleville outshot Milwaukee 12-3. to three. And in total, Belleville outshoots Milwaukee 25-15. to 15. Now on the power play, Milwaukee goes one for one with 13 minutes, five infractions, while Belleville goes 0 for four with seven minutes, two infractions. Going in the first, Martin Jankowski unassisted. Going in the second, Igor Afanasiev on the power play with an assist from Jordan Gross and Joachim Kemmel. Scoring in the third at 3.52 mark for Belleville was Matthew Highmore scoring his first of the year, assisted by Igor Sokolov, his first, and Tyler Clevin, his second. Then at the 7.31 mark, the Admirals get on the board again with a goal by Fedor Svechkov, scoring his first of the year, assisted by Denis Gurianov, his fourth, and Joachim Kemmel, his second. Then at the 16.57, the Admirals put it into an empty net from Zach LaRue, scoring his second of the year, assisted by Kevin Graval, his first. By the way, should we should add that Fedor Svechkov's first North American point. Or, yes. Uh, sorry, North American North goal. North American goal. Yeah, okay. North American goal. I mean, you, these rookies are performing. <clears throat> yeah, they are. It's just, you can perform – and not have chemistry and be okay. Right. Once you get chemistry, there's no looking back. Yeah. So I, I think that that's part of the bigger part there. Um, <coughs> definitely like what I saw in this game. Much better from everyone. Yeah. Looked like they were a little more calm. There were smiles on faces, which really helped. Oh, <laughs> uh, in net for the uh, Bellevue Senators was Mad Sogard. He had, uh, according to this, and I doubt that that is right. There's no way that's right. No. Yeah, it is. is he that had seven saves. On nine shot attempts with two goals against. According to this. According to this. You'd think he'd have three goals against and the empty netter doesn't count towards that. So I think you're right. I think it's wrong. Yeah. I, I mean, and you're <clears throat> missing stats. There's 15 shots on that. How do you have nine say nine shot attempts against on fifteen shots? I'm I'm just confused here a little bit. Yeah. Um, so what I'll say is he had uh, 
a so that one so remove one so 14 shots he had three again so 11 saves on on 15 shots that's what i would say 11 or no i'd say 12 saves on 15 shots 12 saves on 15 shots yeah that's that sounds right 12 saves on 15 shots because it also does have him only playing 39 minutes right they didn't change goalies no no i'm very confused yeah so am i their stat box is wow <laughs> Uh, speaking of wow, that Belleville crowd, 1,681 each. I get it's Wednesday. There's no way. Uh, currently across the division, Iowa is beating Chicago one to nothing. Um, we are the only team playing in our division today, other than Chicago and Iowa. Or Rosemont in Iowa, if you will. Yarrow stopped 24-25. Um, not a bad game from Yarrow. Uh, your referees were Riley Brace and Matthew Menthi Mentini. Um, linesmen were Brian Burkhoff and Jarrett Burton. Uh, the Admirals in previous season were 2-0. Uh, Belleville was 0 and 1, 0 1, 0 and 1. Uh, there was that shootout loss last year. Um, yep. around this time, I think it's actually a year to the day. Um, and the Admiral started going on a run, so every time we play Bellevue, we just go on a run. <laughs> um, all time, the Admirals are now 5 and 0 against Bellevue, yeah. Um, over the last five seasons. Um, your points leaders for the Admirals at the current moment are Dennis Giryanov with five goal or uh, five points, Jokim Kebel with three, uh, Jankowski with three, Fedor Svechkov with three, and Zachary LaRue with two. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about LaRue. Um, do you think the way he's standing up for his teammates? whether it's running his mouth or whatever have you, I think he does have to, at some point, learn the lie. Um, you know, uh, the some of the bad penalties you, you, he shouldn't be taking, and, and it, it, you know? Right. It, it's just not a good look for the organization. That's not the brand of hockey we play. I understand that's the brand of hockey he plays, but you got to clean it up a little bit and, and let your skill do the talking. If you got a problem with a guy, punch him in the face. You know, um, not outside the ice, just drop the gloves and fight him and let it be done. Um, you know, don't let things get in the way. So that's all I got to say on that. Anything you want to add, John? No, I, I thought they looked a lot better tonight. <clears throat> there are some changes they made in the lines, too. That was, I thought, good to see. Yeah, it seems like Felber hasn't done as much as he has, or is, is, is as good as he was last season. Yeah. And I don't know where that that is, but we'll see where we're at with that. But that's all I got. Yeah, that's all I got. Well, that's that's all we got. That's all, folks. See y'all Saturday. <laughs>